Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a wash day for my girls. I have a whole playlist on my channel for mixed kid hair. So what I purchased came from Amazon. It's an inflatable shampoo basin kit set. But apparently a lot of people who use this are elderly or who are in nursing homes. So the people who take care of them use that because obviously some elderly can't get out of the bed. I just thought it was a great idea. So I'm going to test it out. So this is partially a review video. We'll see how well it works and hopefully it's helpful for people, especially for those who have kids with special needs or parents for kids who just really just won't stay still at all. I'm going to show you guys what comes in and then we're going to try it out with Maya and Mariah. Maya has really, really long hair and Mariah has really short hair. So you'll see, depending on your child's hair length, this is going to work for you since it's a portable kit. All right, this is the inflatable shampoo basin kit. It says it comes with the shampoo basin with the water bag. It looks like an enema kit, a waterproof scarf, blanket, which I brought some towels down here anyway. It comes with an air pump with two air nozzles so you can fill it up. Really quickly, this is the product setup. So I'm just showing you everything that came in the container and everything did actually come in it. So that was a great thing because that does not always happen. The biggest gripe I have with this was actually the air pump. The directions weren't as detailed, but that's fine. But the air pump itself was great. I just was not expecting to spend 15 to 20 minutes doing an arm workout. So I would suggest if you guys have one of those air pumps, automatic ones, kind of just lying around, I would use that instead just for a time saver. But otherwise, this again is for the parents out there who have asked me how to get their child more comfortable or to sit still bringing the bathtub or bringing the kitchen sink to your child where they could be more comfortable, say their bedroom or just in the family room watching TV, laying down. This is kind of what this video was inspired by and hopefully is helpful for anyone out there who is, you know, trying to have more peaceful hair washing days. Depending on where you're using the portable wash basin and where you're washing your child's hair will depend on the level of an extended arm workout you will have. One side of the house is the bathroom that I'm filming in right now and I used room temperature water. Now by the time I got to my family room, which is where I actually washed my daughter's hair, the water temperature kind of shifted. Pro tip, make sure that the valve is turned off. When I started pouring the water into the water bag, it started coming out the other end. All right, this didn't come with a hook, so I had to hang it up. Being 100% honest, both my girls loved this water basin because they got to lay down. <laughs> Mariah especially loved this, which speaks volumes because between her and Maya, she's the child that did not like hairstyling and would not sit still and still has her moments to this day. So that speaks volumes that she loved this so much and actually works a little bit better, which you'll see in this video. This works a little bit better for Mariah's hair because her hair is much shorter. It still works for Maya's hair. Like if I was in a pinch and I needed this at like the beach or something where Maya's hair is so long, had a whole bunch of like sand in it or something, or I need to use it right away for whatever reason. I will say that it is much better for shorter hair as you guys can see with Mariah who is just having the time of her life with this. Mariah has shoulder length hair if I were to pull down her actual curls. After rinsing out the conditioner, you guys can see the level the water is at. Washing her hair once and conditioning it once was about a bag and a half of water. You'll see with Maya, there's a whole other process. With draining the water basin out, I found it to be much faster just to dump the water out, but you have to have the space obviously to do that. But if you don't, you just lift the tab that's inside the basin and then just let the water run out through the corner all the way through like the little hose. Now for Maya, if you guys are brand new to my channel, she has hip length hair. And even with her hair curly in its natural state, her hair is still very long and it takes up the entire shower basin. As I was washing her hair, this is something that I quickly realized that will work better for Mariah since she already doesn't sit still naturally, but mainly because she has much shorter hair compared to Maya's hair. Now, like I said earlier, I would use this only if this were like a dire need and we were on the go, we were out somewhere, because this is something that you could, you know, honestly take in your car if you needed to. But as you guys can tell, as I was wringing her hair out, I had to put it on the waterproof scarf that came with the kit because her hair was still sitting in the water. And because I had so much water in this and I wasn't done washing her hair, I could have, but I just didn't go dump it out and put it back because I was kind of defeating the purpose of making this like a wash and go kit, as it were. It worked just fine with me putting her hair around her neck and everything like that, but this is definitely something that worked a lot better for Mariah with shorter hair. Compared to the sink? Yeah, but it's got a little cold. Oh. All right, so this is the aftermath of Maya's hair, at least. It was uh -huh. Yeah, the camera's not really showing the true color of it. If you found this video helpful, please let me know in the comment section down below because this might be like a, a complete stretch as to me posting this video. But as you can tell, Mariah is still my child who has her moments where she does not like hair styling as Maya does. So if you thought this video would be helpful for you or you try it out, anything like that, please let me know in the comment section down below. Subscribe and I'll see you in the next video. Bye. Thanks for watching.